Welcome, welcome, welcome back. This is me, early morning, before the battle. Me and Glaceon have not got to talk. Our schedules haven't lined up. I did make a team of sorts that I will go over with him. Um, ideally, hopefully, you know, hopefully we can even talk before the battle about the team. But I think this is going to be the team as of now. So, you can see over here, I will be explaining everything. On the other side is the team that I am facing. The team that I am facing is extremely, extremely good. Um, they have been bodying everybody. I don't think they've lost yet. They were, I think, third place last season. Um, and they've just been at the top of the game every time. So... Yet another really, really tough challenge, but one that I think we'll have some fun with. So, that being said... Um, yeah, so... Um, looking at their team, I see a bunch of big threats. Um, Indeedy is interesting because, you know, it obviously has Psychic Surge, and Psychic Surge is really good for my team. And not so good for theirs. They have Dusk and Wire, Mian Shao, Sloking, Mega Camerupt, Dewblade, Purloin. They just traded for Purloin. Um, they have Fracture, Rillaboom. They just traded for Rillaboom, which makes this a little bit of a more bigger problem. Flygon, Pachirisu, and Braviary. So, Rillaboom can set up Grassy. Grassy Glide, Grassy Terrain. Um, so I needed essentially a way to get rid of them. And Meowstic is my one. My my get rid of uh, Psychic Terrain. Or get rid of Grassy Terrain. So I did bring that. Uh, but our biggest threats... Oh, excuse me. Our biggest threats are definitely going to be the Rillaboom, Flygon, Mega Camerupt, and Mian Shao. Everything else, I think, will deal with itself. Um, so, that being said, um, I am bringing Greninja because I we won the first match because of Eruption, Mega, or Mega. We won with Terrifier, Camerupt, Eruption. Um, so, I... And Mega Camerupt in Trick Room is going to be the slowest thing that they have. Um, and it's going to do a lot of work, so I'm pretty scared of it. But also, I brought Ice Beam for... So I brought... Um, I didn't bring a Water Type Moon on Greninja. Um, which I think is a bold play, because I just told you how scared I am of Mega Camerupt. I'm infinitely more scared of Mian Shell. Um, because Mian Xiao gets fake out, um, and Mian Xiao is fast and bodies a lot of things. So it's a really good lead, but I have the Covert Cloak on so that I don't get flinched by fake out. I am faster than Mian Xiao, and I do one shot with Protein with Extra Sensory. With um, Torrent, I do not. So, you know, I didn't. I don't really like the new changes to Protein, but it's kind of whatever. Plus, this is a Terra Pokemon, so, you know, I can Terra out of Psychic um, and back to Dark um, if need be. So I have Extra Sensory for literally just me and Xiao. Um, yeah, I don't think it's anything else super effective. Um, I obviously have Dark Pulse, because as you can see, there's a lot of Psychic and Dark types. So we got Indeedy Female, Dusk Noir, um, Slowbro, Dewblade, um, all those Pokemon are hit by Dark Pulse. And a Stab Dark Pulse from Greninja is going to hurt, no matter who it is. Um, I already said I'm running Ice Beam. Ice Beam is primarily for Rillaboom, but you know also it's Fracture, Flygon, and Braviary for super effective. So, yeah, <clears throat> I'm running Protect. I'll talk about my leads in a little bit, but I'm running Protect just in case they do the worst lead possible. Like, they absolutely play me, you know? 
Um, I'm running Victini here. Um, their team is not fast, but it's not slow. They have a couple faster mons. So they have two base 100 Pokemon. So they're, uh, they're two base 100 Pokemon, right? Their base 105 is uh, Mianxiao, which I don't know if could body Victini, but I don't want to risk it. Um, and then Flygon. Flygon's base 100. So those two are really, really scary. Everything else is slower. Which means... I think Victini is pretty safe here. Um, plus, I put on Focus Ash. I ha I'm running physical... I'm running a mixed set. So I'm running V-Create, obviously. V-Create just absolutely um, bodies things. I'm running Zen Headbutt because... Um, Zen Headbutt is stronger on... Mian Xiao. Um, and I think Psychic doesn't kill. I'm pretty sure I counted. it. Um, but Zen Headbutt does more damage. Um, Zen Headbutt does more damage even with mass, max special attack. I'm pretty sure. Does more damage to other things. Maybe not Flygon. I don't know. I don't remember. I know I had a reason for Zen Headbutt. I want Protect on there just because Protect is good. Um, and Victini having a timely protect might win us the game. <coughs> I put Glaciate on there, specifically for Flygon. I do think they're going to tear a Flygon, but Glaciate also lowers speed, which might help us in the long run. Yeah. I bring a Lola and Marowak, um, just because they do have two Pokemon with Fake Out, being Rillaboom and Mianxiao. Um, I thought it would be... Pretty good, since we're running Victini and Slowking, I thought it would be really good to run a slower Pokemon if I need it. So, yeah. Um, Marowak, you know, Marowak, I, like I said, lead fake out. You can't fake out a ghost type. Um, he's got Thick Club. He has Lightning Rod for the Pachirisu. Not that I think is going to hit us, but... You know, it's always there. The other two abilities are even more situational. So we're rocking Stomping Tantrum specifically for the Pachirisu. Um, most of these moves hit a lot of things. We got Knock Off for Ndidi, Duskenwire, Slowbro, Dublade specifically because it's going to be rocking Eviolite. Um, we have, we could use it on Fracture. Um, we could use it on everything, but, you know, it hits hits everything pretty hard. Make a camera up, it won't. Won't do any damage to. Then I have Protect on him as well. Mostly I just have Protect in case we want a Trick Room. Um, but uh, I have Thick Club on him as well. I think, you know, I think he just kills everything. Um, I have Flare Blitz. So I have Flare Blitz specifically for Rillaboom. Lead Rillaboom to kill it. Because if Rillaboom is not there... Our life is definitely easier. Then we have speed control. Rillaboom is so fucking strong. It's so good. Uh, Magic Man. Magic Man. Um, Slow King. Slow King is there for Victini to reset its stat changes from V-Create. Um, it also has Trick Room. Um, it has Ice Beam. Scald. Um, Psychic. So Ice Beam again for... Braviary, Flygon, Rillaboom. Uh, yeah, I think that's it. And then, you know, Scald is specifically for Mega Camerupt. Specifically for Mega Camerupt. I'm running Room Service, so if they Trick Room and want to bring out Mega Camerupt, I'm going to be slower than Mega Camerupt with zero speed. So, yeah, that is kind of a... Kind of good... Um, I do have Charlie. Charlie is... I, I also have Psychic on Magic Man for Mian Xiao. Not that I'll really need it. It also hits Slow Bro for neutral damage. So, yeah, hopefully I'm faster than a Slow Bro. Um, I also have Charlie, which is the Meowstic, which is our fake-out Pokemon. And it has the Prankster Psychic Terrain. 
Um, I have the grassy seed on it. I don't know what to put on this thing, and you know, I'm gonna be bringing it out when Rilla Boom is is out to take away its grassy terrain. That's the ideal situation, so I'm gonna pop the grassy seed anyway. I really don't have another item on this thing, and I know somebody's gonna talk crap on me for that. Um, I am running um, signal beam. Um, signal beam uh, for Rillaboom. I'm also running Dark Pulse for the many, many things that are weak to Dark. So, yeah. No stab psychic move in Psychic Drain. Mm -hmm. I also have Sock here. I really didn't have anything that would go against this team super, super well. Um, so I tried to kind of throw a hodgepodge of Pokemon at it. And this is definitely where Sock comes in. Sock is really strong. Um, and it hits like a truck. And it can be fast. So with all of their kind of neutral speed, I can almost guarantee to outspeed things, especially on the second hit with Salak Berry. Um, they do have a couple Pokemon with um, with moves um, with priority moves, which kind of sucks. But Salak with Sturdy Salak Berry, I have Knock Off, Quick Guard. So Knock Off, obviously, you know, for all those Pokemon. I have Quick Guard for all those um, speedy attacks. Close Combat, obviously, Close Combat is just good, and with my Sky High attack stat, it's not going to be a problem. It's going to hit things really, really hard, especially Purloin. Um, and then Rock Slide. You know, Rock Slide's always good for flinching. It does a bunch of damage. We like Rock Slide here. Rock Slide likes us. <laughs> Alright. <coughs> Let's talk leads. So... <coughs> <coughs> so leads <coughs> I obviously want to lead Marowak and I think you know fake out is obviously coming first turn <laughs> which means if I lead Marowak <coughs> if I lead Marowak and they lead a fake out Pokemon they're going to fake out Greninja and Greninja is Covert Cloak and it's not going to work that's my plan <coughs> and I Kill something with Marowak, almost guaranteed, or I kill something with Greninja, or both. And then I get two kills, and I'm sitting there with uh, two kills and six Pokemon. That's the ideal situation. Um, but, you know, this guy's really good. He's probably going to see right through that. I predict um, his best thing that would mess my lead up, <coughs> his absolute perfect lead, would be <coughs> running Rillaboom and... Well, I don't know. His worst lead would be Rillaboom, I think. Because his worst lead would be Rillaboom and something with knockoff. Because um, Rillaboom is obviously going to try to classy, classy glide the Greninja. Greninja is not fast enough or it doesn't have the priority that it needs to live the grassy glide. Um, so what I'm going to do if that happens is protect Greninja and then Flare Blitz the Rillaboom. That's my plan. That's the plan that's the plan. And then <coughs> Flare Blitz guaranteed kills. It's like 200% on Rillaboom. But... If somebody knock off, knocks off the Thick Club, I have like a 99% chance of killing with Flare Blitz. Still, with it knocked off. So, yeah. <clears throat> I, um... That's, that's my plan. That's my plan for leads. Is if they completely read it and they don't fake out anything. I still kill. So... Yeah, that's my plan. <coughs> Hopefully I get a run up by Glaceon. Hopefully Glaceon's just there for the fight. I really hope so. Um, but this one's kind of a my team build. I've been slowly throughout the week, I've just been adding stuff to it until I get a full team. And then even after I get a full team, I made some changes. So, yeah. I don't know. This will be a tough one. My In my brain, I can't see him beating me because I can't figure out how he would beat me. 
but um, but he's really really good and you know he's gonna be able to to push me I think I don't know all right I am gonna go ahead and get out of here I have to go catch a haircut appointment so I will talk I was gonna say I'll talk to you later I'm not on a discord call Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like the video, leave a like, comment, subscribe to everything the YouTubers tell you to do. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!